Okay, what you're seeing here is just a nice assortment of uh, Pilgrim Glass uh, from Pilgrim Glass Company. Uh, normally, this stuff doesn't really have a lot of great value, and I'm not really going to put it on eBay or anything, but the reason I'm filming it is just because I had a hard time. I was just doing some research. I couldn't really find much on the stuff, and I figured I'd just show each piece so this uh, way other people could see it, easily identify it, hopefully. Uh, some of it has labels. I'm really just going to go through this really quickly. Okay, here we go. Um, this is a, uh, I would call this an opalescent uh, apple uh, with stripes. It, there's also a pear, um, which so I'm assuming this is a set. Um, this has uh, a regular bottom, not ponto. Okay, uh, con oops. Uh, continuing with the opalescent, here's just, uh, I would say that's like a, a coin spot design, uh, a vase of some site, and I have a pitcher. You can see the picture uh, that has kind of a rough ponto bottom. Um, going back, here's another picture, pretty much the same coin spot, applied handle. Um, yeah, not really much of a ponto. Um, here's another picture, a uh, different shape, An applied handle, coin spot again. Um, here's another picture that's opalescent. Uh, this has kind of a stripe design. Uh, and then probably I would say the piece de resistance of uh, the striped uh, things uh, opalescent would be this fish, which is actually pretty cool. You know, applied glass, good shape. All right, now we'll just run through quickly, say with uh, some of these crack. Uh, here's a couple of crackle glass pitchers. Uh, uh, nice. Uh, they come in some different colors. There's uh, some that are red and. Uh, blue and there's some um, as an amber and there's kind of like uh, uh, these obviously you can see they have labels on them which easily identify them that one is it's a it's a yellow color I don't remember uh, it's like uh, Vaseline maybe okay then we just have some regular vases and uh, these aren't really very exciting or anything but um, I don't know if I mentioned this I bought this glass from a woman who said her dad worked for the Pilgrim Glass Company, so that's why I can uh, pretty much I say, okay, this is all Pilgrim Glass. All right, getting back to here. Here's a decanter that's in a yellow color uh, with a stopper. Um, it has kind of, I don't know if you can see it, but it has kind of a rough ponto bottom. Um, these vases did not have ponto bottoms. These pitchers, uh, kind of ponto bottoms. All right, now getting back to uh, some of the other glass. Uh, here's just some red. Uh, I think um, they call this basically amberina glass. Okay, and this is a pitcher with a hobnail design. Um, ponto bottom, kind of snapped. Uh, here is another pitcher. Oops, not going to step over. Um, here's two more pitchers, kind of with the uh, optic designs or reverse optic designs. Uh, no ponto bottom. Then we have an assortment of cranberry glass pitchers, which you can see here. Um, there's a bottle with a stopper, pretty much the same thing, different designs. Um, then this stuff would, I would say, would be peach glow. Um, pitchers mostly, uh, kind of pop up designs with the Pilgrim Glass Company labels. Um, then there's some more pitchers here. You can see all different kinds. These again would be uh, peach blow, I believe, is what you call them another picture there. Here's some fruit. The apples and uh, pears again. Two sets it looks like. These have uh, smooth bottoms. Here's another picture that's kind of that peach blow uh, with an, a coin spot design. And um, here's a squirrel with a pet paperweight which is kind of here. Let me see if I get that a little less glary. That's a squirrel with kind of a Peach blown color, satin finish. Uh, the peach blow stuff has satin finishes. And uh, the last piece I'm going to show that I have got in this collection would be a, a kind of a spatter design. And it, I would say it's amber in color with uh, white spatter. Okay, that's it. Um, hope this helps you in identifying your pilgrim glass.